So guys, um, we have stopped in Eureka. The Sam's did an incredible drive last night to get us here. We are stopping by this mechanics, which uh, he's currently at his lunch break, but we have a problem starting the Wonderbug. Um, the battery's fine, all the mechanical work done yesterday seems to be great, uh, but there's probably a wire loose or something, so we're gonna just check it out before we head off on the rest of our road trip. I don't know where the others are, I think they've gone for breakfast somewhere. In the meantime, we're just gonna cruise around on my new boosted board that they gave me yesterday. <laughs> so we've given up waiting for Bill. He was taking a very long time on his lunch break. So we're gonna pop out and get some, get another breakfast. We had breakfast when we arrived at 7 a.m. and now it's time for another breakfast. And we also want to catch up with the other guys because we didn't see them last night because we were like so far behind. Really? It's like two separate road trips at the moment. We need to be yeah. more united. This is land of dreams. <laughs> Sam, show us what we bought. So we got, uh, we, the whole time, the, the bug, provides everything except space for us to put our drinks and Louis spilled his coffees twice this morning. Two J separate Just today, coffees. just today. Just today. Uh, so we're getting a cup holder thing uh, which we're going to put mount on top of the subwoofer in the middle of the car to solve all our problems. Sweet. And bought some oil. Now Sam's looking for a hairbrush. We're getting all... First time I've ever had to do this in my life. <laughs> we're getting all the essentials. Can we, ask, can we ask everyone what they think? Right. Should I cut my hair or should I leave it? Like, comments, please help me out. Let's have a little poll. Yeah, let's do it. Guys, let them know. Detangle and style. I have no idea, bro. Maybe I should just brush it now. That'll be good for the next few months. This guy? This is like the only guy out, not in a packet. Yeah, the pink ones. Oh! <laughs> Oh, that's so satisfying. It feels so good. I haven't probably brushed this ever. It's like a flowing mane now. You've got that. Thanks, mate. Right. right. Let's right. see if this fits. The console organizer. Oh, bro, it might be a little bit too big. I reckon it's going to be perfect. Yeah? Because it's not far off. So we've arrived at Dennis's place. He's gonna have a little look at the engine and the uh, wiring and stuff. So we had a fire and it melted all this, this seal and then some of the wires got charred a little bit. So I taped them up, but they didn't look damaged. But this is all part of the adventure though, bro. I mean like, this is, this is what makes the, the journey and the story. Like, yeah. It wouldn't be a story without a complication. It also feels like when we overcome these problems, it's like this sense of like... She lives to see another day. Yeah, yeah. We're like succeeding. We're making it happen. We're also slowly just ticking off all the problems that she has. Like soon she'll be a brand new car yeah. and it'll be amazing. <laughs> That's a good sign, guys. That means the alternator's charging the battery, I think. Try and turn the key, Sam, so show them what happens. So situation update is we've diagnosed the problem is the starter motor and it was more than just the wiring. <laughs> Sam's having fun. Uh, it, it's more than just the wiring, it's, um, it's the starter motor itself which needs replacing so it's getting a bit late in the day but we're going to try and get a, a replacement and see if Dennis can fit it for us before we continue up. I think it's a wise idea. Oh look. This is the starter guys. This is what Dennis just took out of the Wonderbug. <laughs> Wonderbug. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and okay. the replacement has just arrived. Thank you for bringing it. Oh, hey, it's Boy, yeah, you, you can look down in there and just see they're all just broken off. Oh yeah. Guys, moment of truth. It's a miracle! 
Yeah. Sam's just shown Dennis the booster board. <laughs> we bought this drinks cup holder unit earlier in Walmart. Dennis has just lent us his power drill. <laughs> and we're just getting these last screws in. Oi. Oh! Check that out. Mate! Now, look, we can just put our Gatorade there. Oh! <laughs> One blow. Walmart strikes again. So we're well on our way to meet up with the other guys. We're just driving through Golden Hour and I just pulled over. I'm trying to find somewhere to fill up gas. But look, I just found this guy. What the? Hello. Big emu. Guys, turns out emus love popcorn. You want some popcorn? You want some? It's vicious, I'm telling you. Look, the popcorn, not my finger, bro, the popcorn. Ready? Ah! <laughs> Most birds are this big in Australia. Yeah, this is an Australian bird, look. Second largest of all birds. This, this bird is on our coat of arms. Um, and as you know, Australia is the only country in the world that eat its coat of arms. We eat kangaroo and we eat emu steaks. <laughs> which kind of sucks, it's pretty, it's pretty bad, we shouldn't do that. <laughs> So as you can see guys right by this emu, there's this sign that says tore through tree and the trees around here are massive like giant redwood trees. Apparently there's one right here that we can drive the wonder bug through. We can drive through the tree. Right, let's see if we can get this bad boy through the tree. Yeah. We're driving through a tree. Oh my gosh, we're inside the tree. <laughs> yeah. We're going through. We're going through again. This is the weirdest sensation, guys, being inside a tree. The trees are real big around here. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. What? Yeah. Woo! How's it feel booster boarding for a tree, Sam? It's definitely a first. <laughs> but Do you think it's the first time someone's booster boarded through this tree? I, yeah, I'd definitely. I'd, I'd go on a limit. So I, I plan over the next six months to booster board over and under and through everything I possibly <laughs> humanly can. Any hole you can find. Any <laughs> hole, I'll, I'll boost it through. <laughs> Wait, we're inside a tree, boys. <laughs> I don't think I've been inside Not a tree often. How is it still alive? How is it still alive? That's mad, isn't it?
we've entered a part of America with like zero cell service on any network. Thankfully, I've just managed to retrieve my, uh, my map to get directions to where we're going. Bro, we're not gonna get there till half 10. So it's probably a good idea to get some snacks in. Hey, what's the best snack? Ice cream cookie. Another crusade in my yet unhealthy tour through America. <laughs> Two chocolate chip cookies with some ice cream. It's amazing. Where is the read, dog? Read the, where's your okay, we've definitely private property? Now, How are we going to turn around? Oh no. Okay, we definitely should have read this paragraph that uh, Marco sent us. Oh, it's just so long though. I know. I don't do paragraphs. <laughs> we were sent a massive email. Um, with directions how to get to the Airbnb, which is like in the middle of nowhere in the forest. It was such a long email that we just didn't read it because it was just a lot of effort. So we've been following Google Maps, but apparently it's taken us down the wrong road to like a locked gate at the bottom of a very steep track. And now we can't turn around. Let's go up, like, out into a place. Take a three point here. <laughs> Go forward, go forward. Should be good now. I love these signs. Hold on, boys. Oh, Robbie. Where's the jump? Woo! Oh, we lost the hubcap. Right, we found this note on the van. No means yes. Park here, walk up to the lodge with your staff, go lightweight, at the treehouse, follow road to the right. I think we can carry on going, bro. Should we put out? We're ignoring the <laughs> we're ignoring the sign. So what what did the sign say? It said <laughs> it said go up further and then take a right at the treehouse. Oh bro, guys, look at the treehouse. Oh, tree oh yeah. Like we've gone up? Yeah. Full pelt. <laughs> oh my god. Four drive only. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Full pelt, bro, full pelt. Go, go, go. You got this, you got this. You got this. Yes, buddy. Dude, what a mission. Yeah. I was like, that means it's a long walk, and that means they don't believe in us. We were all, bet we were all betting, we were like, no, for sure they're gonna try to drive the truck or the van. Of course we are. Dude, we were full no. like sliding that, that out. That was not, I thought we were gonna die. Good to see you, man. Good to see you. Dude, this place is nice. We got proper lost. We had the best adventure. I, we know, we know, we know. It was like, dude, we were just talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Hey! I'm so rude! Mm. Wait, wait, yeah. you guys can catch We're here! We're here. Yeah. We made it! Yeah. Yeah. So welcome to the Eco Lodge in the middle of the forest. Yeah. There's three nice. stories here, there's like five beds, and it's Pool all table. off the grid. Look at that hangout! I'm area. so happy we're back with you guys, because we were like sad that we've been having two separate road trips, but yeah. now we're back. Alright, I'm just reheating the dinner that these guys cooked earlier. And then we're going to play some games. Right, well, it's almost 1 a.m. I'm gonna grab my stuff out of the wonder bug. And then we're gonna try and get some sleep. I think we're gonna stay here tomorrow, guys. Um, if we can book this another night, and we're just gonna spend some time out here. It's like a retreat out in the woods. Um, there's no internet, there's zero way of me getting my vlogs up, but there might be a chance for me to whiz into town, like a nearby town tomorrow, sort of things. It's been a, it's been a good day. We've overcome another mechanical problem, and 
yeah, we found ourselves here. <sighs> Peace out, enjoy life, and live the adventure. Boom.